Hello and welcome to today's video. In this video, we'll be discussing the topic of why the US government wants to ban TikTok. Over the past few years, TikTok has become one of the most popular social media platforms in the world. With over a billion active users, the platform has gained immense popularity among young people worldwide. Yeah, baby! <laughs> However, TikTok's rise to fame has been marred with controversies, especially in the US. The US government has raised concerns over the app's security, data privacy, and censorship policies, leading to calls for a ban on the platform. So why does the US government want to ban TikTok? Let's find out. Firstly, the US government is concerned about the app's ties to the Chinese government. TikTok is owned by ByteDance, a Chinese-based company which has raised concerns among U.S. lawmakers about the potential for the Chinese government to access user data. In 2017, China passed a national intelligence law that requires Chinese companies to cooperate with the country's intelligence services. This has raised concerns that TikTok could be used to spy on U.S. citizens or used to influence U.S. politics. These concerns have been heightened by the ongoing trade war between the U.S. and China. Secondly, the U.S. government has concerns over TikTok's data privacy policies. The app collects vast amounts of data from its users, including personal information, location data, and browsing history. The U.S. government is concerned that this data could be used for malicious purposes, such as identity theft or cyber attacks. The U.S. Federal Trade Commission FTC, has fined TikTok $5.7 million for violating children's privacy laws. In addition, the U.S. Department of Justice has opened a national security review into TikTok's acquisition of Musical.ly, a U.S.-based app that was later merged into TikTok. Thirdly, the U.S. government is concerned about TikTok's censorship policies. TikTok has faced criticism for censoring content that is critical of the Chinese government. In addition, the app has been accused of censoring content related to political and social issues in other countries, such as Hong Kong and Taiwan. The U.S. government is concerned that this censorship could be used to promote the Chinese government's agenda or to suppress free speech. Lastly, the U.S. government is concerned about the potential for TikTok to be used for misinformation campaigns. The app has been accused of spreading false information and propaganda, especially during the COVID-19 pandemic. There have also been concerns that TikTok could be used to interfere in U.S. elections or to spread propaganda aimed at U.S. citizens. Given these concerns, the U.S. government has taken several steps to limit TikTok's reach in the country. In August 2020, President Trump issued an executive order that would ban TikTok from the U.S. unless it was sold to a U.S.-based company. The order cited concerns over national security and data privacy. In September 2020, the U.S. Department of Commerce issued a ban on new downloads of the app in the U.S., citing the same concerns. In December 2020, a federal judge blocked the ban but the case is still ongoing. In response to these concerns, TikTok has taken steps to address the U.S. government's concerns. The app has hired U.S.-based executives, established a U.S.-based data center, and announced plans to create a new company, TikTok Global, with U.S.-based partners. However, these steps have not been enough to alleviate the U.S. government's concerns, and the future of TikTok in the U.S. remains uncertain. In conclusion, the U.S. government's concerns over TikTok have highlighted the need for greater scrutiny and accountability when it comes to social media platforms. While TikTok has become a cultural phenomenon, it is important to remember the potential risks and concerns associated with its use. We hope that this video has provided you with valuable insights into why the U.S. government wants to ban TikTok and what it means for the future of the app in the U.S. Thank you for watching.